All right, cool. So, you know, what's going on there by the YouTube land? Now, I'm finna give y'all some Xbox 360 exclusives. Uh, we gonna call this the Stella Blade. <laughs> Xbox Stella Blade Edition, FOMO Guide, part one. So, and you, you can see, you, you already know what the theme for a lot of these games are gonna be. But I got about 20 games I wanna show y'all. So, before we get into it, let's have a quick word from our sponsors, which is me. I sponsor my own video. Take 10 seconds out your time, and we're going to get into these games. Let's go. All right, so let's go ahead and get into We're going to start off with Venetica. Ven Very cool game, man. Um, to me personally, this game is worth about $5. Maybe 10 To me personally, like a personal value of what I think somebody should pay for it. You go on eBay, they charge anywhere from thirty five to fifty dollars. They they charge the crackhead prices for this game. I cannot recommend it at these prices. I do not think now is the time to be collecting Xbox three sixty. But I, I I I'm just doing this to let you guys know about some games that haven't gone crazy yet, that might possibly go crazy in the future once people start getting the the you got the you got the games that's out right now that everybody is talking about, but this is this is the second tier game that's going to be behind. Everybody is talking about Bullet Rich, Need for Speed Most Wanted, which makes no sense. That game is so expensive. That game was coming as hell. You got you got a lot of people talking about a lot of goofy games like the Operation Darkness and Darkest of Days just finally got on that list. So I'm I'm talking about the second batch of games that a lot of people are, uh won't 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 be hip to till it's too late. Venetica is definitely in that mode. So let's go to the next joint and see what they talking about. Uh, for the next game, we got Remember Me. The name is Nilly. This time, you'll remember me. Okay, cool. This is another game I think might catch steam. I just got a feeling this game is going to catch steam, man. Right now, Price Chart got it for $10, and eBay is respecting Price Chart's mind for selling this thing for $10. I want you guys to understand this when it comes to Xbox 360. Don't go by total sales of Xbox 360 games. Nobody took the Xbox 360 seriously. Nobody took care of their games. Everybody had these Xbox 360 games out of the cases stacked on top of each other. This really wasn't a, a console that you went to if you was a serious gamer. This was the most casual console possible. Like in the history of console, like nobody like took this Xbox 360 thing seriously. So it's, it's, it's going to be a lot of games out there. But a lot of these games, even if you go on eBay, they tell you the games don't work. So, uh, $10 for that game, I say, I think it's a good deal. You need to take advantage of it if you can find a good copy. So, we're going to go from there. We're going to go to Velvet Assassin. I I think this is uh, uh I think this is a uh, Xbox 360 exclusive if I'm not if I'm not um if I'm not wrong. This is one of those games that's not a hidden gem, but people are going to make it into a hidden gem. <laughs> 5 years from now you're going to see people doing hidden gem videos and they're just going to put it on they're they going to throw it on here cuz it's it's uncommon. It's uncommon. That's that's the only reason why they're going to make it a hidden gem, man. And this one done is already at 70, man. 
It's already at 70 on eBay. Uh, definitely not worth that. If you can find somebody selling it for price chart prices, $21, you can thrift store, uh, pawn shop, something like that, then I, I would say pull the trigger on it. But $75, hell no. Then we got Bayonetta. You want to touch me? Come on. The best, the best place for me, I think, to play this game on is Xbox, Xbox 360. But it's definitely on a whole bunch of other places. Uh, this isn't, this is even the only copy of Bayonetta. You can get Bayonetta two with the with the Bayonetta one bonus disc in it and play it like that. But you know, that's neither here nor there. Right now, you can get this game thirteen dollars on eBay. Uh, will it be rare? Well, I go back to my Xbox 360 analogy. It was popular on the Xbox 360, yes, but at the same time, nobody, literally nobody took care of their ass. Even Professor Joe Casey is guilty of not taking care of his Xbox 360 games. <laughs> of course, I wasn't a, a big collector at the time, and I, I mainly bought these games to keep the kids busy and, you know, to keep them from bothering me when I was doing daddy duties. You know, I, I let them play some stupid Xbox games, and and when they'll be in in a room playing Xbox all damn day. But we didn't take care of them CDs, man. Nobody did, nobody. So, you know, take that Bayonetta being thirteen dollars now with a grain of salt. Let's move on to another game that's cheap right now: Tomb Raider Legends. Another cheat game. Another game that people is these are the type of games that just they gonna it's gonna be a lot of sneakers on the Xbox 360. Notice how when when PlayStation 3 took off, you, you everybody, you know, it, it wasn't it wasn't enough heavy hitters for the PlayStation 3, considering all the games that actually came out on it. It's gonna be more than enough heavy hitters for the 360, because so many games that wouldn't normally be a heavy hitter are going to just be in rare, rare quantity due to how many people want them due to how many damaged copies are out there. Nobody's going to want the test, the not working copies. But I've seen people on eBay actually trying to sell non-working copies of Xbox 360 games. <laughs> it's crazy. For $20 and $30, they tell you, game don't work. <laughs> game is scratched to hell. But they still want $30 for a loose disc, it's man, it, it, it's baffling, <laughs> and they selling, <laughs> and they selling. So let me go ahead and get y'all one more game. I'm gonna get y'all a big one before I get out of here. I'm gonna get y'all one more juice. I'm gonna give you guys Agoris a war. しぼり出せた日何も怖がらずまだかになれた言いたいことはごく単純で愛しているんだそばにいてほしいなだけど少し汚れて these Agoris games, man. I'm telling you, man, if you can get them for the PlayStation or the Xbox 360, they're sleeper titles on both 
systems. I don't know why. I just got a feeling these games are going to take off. Uh, Agarist Award for the Xbox 360. And uh, record of Agarist War 2. And record of Agarist War 0. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. I think these things are going to take off, man. Uh, so, like I say, man, if you see them right now, like $15 CIB price charting, $20 with free shipping on Amazon. I can't tell you what type of uh I can't tell you what type of condition those games are gonna come in off of Amazon though. And 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 you can get fooled by the pictures. You people know people know exactly how to take pictures of their Xbox 360 games to kind of blotch out the disc rock. To kind of blotch out the, the crazy scratches. Man, they'll get you, man. They'll get you. And it'd be too much hassle, man, to just be taking that shit bike and, and doing all that stuff. And it just, man, hey, they'll get you with the Xbox 360 game. So, you know, y'all be cool with that. Be careful with that. And, uh, yeah, uh, that's it, man. I can go deeper, but I don't want to, man. I'm tired, man. I'll holler at y'all. Y'all be cool.